Hey guys, AJ here back with another one for you. So guys, we have all these single moms whining about how hard it is to be a single mom all over TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, and all this other stuff, right? Clown world. And guys, a lot of these chicks, like they get ghosted the moment that they tell Chad and Tyrone that they're pregnant. Homeboy says, <laughs> and then they go to TikTok and cry about how hard it was going through their pregnancy alone. <laughs> so guys, we're going to look at some of these knuckleheads on TikTok complaining about how hard it was to be pregnant and give birth all by themselves. But before we do that, guys, like, subscribe, drop a comment, because it really helps keep this channel going. Check out my second channel link in the description. And check out the playlist at the end, guys, for more videos just like this. And let's get into this. I'm sure we could all agree that heartbreak hurts, right? But you know what hurts even more? Going through pregnancy alone. Clown world. Now, that's a feeling I will never forget because I feel like that's the time where I was supposed to be in my soft, feminine era. I was supposed to be nurtured and taken care of. But I went through my pregnancy alone. So... I had to be the strongest I had ever been in my whole entire life. Guys, what was that popping noise she just made with her lips? Did you hear that? So, I had to... Ah! Be ah! <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, Jesus. Strongest I had ever been in my whole entire life. <sighs> I will never get over it. It's just so hard because you don't want your baby to feel everything you're feeling. And you like, even the doctor tells you, you know, your baby will feel all of your feelings. So it's hard. You either bottle it up inside and let it eat at you or you cry and cry your whole entire pregnancy. Don't even get me started on the hormones and then feel horrible about it because you know, your baby is going through it too. It, it was hard. It was trying. Well, that's why you don't let... Guys, here's basically how her life was before, before the baby, right? Oh, Chad! <laughs> oh, Tyrone! <laughs> Letting him shoot up the club, and then she ended up pregnant, right? Traumatizing. That's what makes me not want another baby like ever again. Just the fear of going through it alone again. But if you're in it right now, you could do it. I got through it. We're alive and <laughs> thriving now, but it was hard. I love you. Bye. Look at that, guys. So, sh so she didn't say, guys, don't be me. Don't do what I did. I was a moron. No, 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 no. She say, guys, I got through it. You can too, clown world. Guys are hashtags. Hashtag first time mom. Hashtag single mom. Hashtag postpartum. Hashtag mom life. Hashtag pregnancy alone. Hashtag alone. Hashtag abandoned. Look at look at that. Guys, they bring this on themselves. Clown world. Because if I could explain to anybody how lonely pregnancy is. Oh please. I I can't put it into words. I'm just so like frustrated with how I feel and it's I'm just ready to have my baby. Look at this guys. Look at these raptor claws. Look at these tattoos. She has one in her cleavage. She has one right there on her chest, all on her arm. And she's got a cross right there, please. Guys, these are these chicks that are like, I'm all about Jesus. But they're out there banging and clanging, right? Come on, dude. Clown world. And, and she's having a child out of wedlock. I don't think Jesus would like that. Right? Come on. But also terrified of postpartum. Oh, I just hate every emotion that I feel. You, do you guys see the tattoo down there? Did you see it? And guys, this is why you marry before you carry. Like, I just want to be away from my body. Mm -hmm. 
I just feel like it's not talked about enough. You know why it's not talked about enough, guys? Because all these chicks, all these strong and independent chicks, I am woman, hear me roar, the number's too big to ignore. They're all capping. Cap, 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 cap. Just like if you go to TikTok now, guys, you will only see stories of IVF working, but you don't see, guys, IVF works less than 20% of the time, and that's an ideal condition, right? Well, most of the time, it's less than 15%. And once you're in your 40s, it's like less than 7%. But you go to TikTok and Instagram, you would think that all these chicks are having IVF work. Clown world. So guys, how is it that, that, that these chicks can talk out of both sides of their mouth? They're strong and independent, don't need men. We can raise kids on our own. Well, we don't need men. But then you see them crying. Ah, 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 I can't do this on my own. Ah, right? <laughs> And guys, her hashtags, hashtags moms of TikTok, hashtag pregnant TikTok, hashtag pregnant life, hashtag third trimester, hashtag postpartum, hashtag preg pregnant and alone, hashtag alone, hashtag need help. Guys, don't feel bad for him. Clown work. <laughs> hey, guys, <laughs> wait for it because you're going to hear. Uh, a telltale sign of how you know that she's single and pregnant, all right? So it's so crazy because, like... <laughs> Did you guys hear the smoke detector in the background? <laughs> That's how you know that there's no man in the house, man. <laughs> And then she has a nerve to get on TikTok and make a video with that thing beeping. And you can even see it in the background on the ceiling. <laughs> oh, guys, the best things in life are free. <laughs> you guys. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Not how much love you receive or like how many friends and family are like checking on you. Pregnancy can still feel very lonely. And especially if you don't have like mom friends, I don't have any mom friends or a lot of mom friends. I don't have any close mom friends, let's say that. Um, so it can feel real lonely. So if you're out there and you're pregnant right now and you're feeling lonely, no, you're not the only <laughs> there one. There it is. Um, but maybe, I don't know. I don't even know. I don't know. Cause I don't even have a solution to my own problems. I don't even know why I even made this TikTok, but we on the same, we on the same boat. That's all I want to say. Guys, and no one in the con con comments, all these 304s are, are posting in her comments, and no one's saying, can you please change that smoke detector battery? How do they not notice that? How? How? How do you just hear beep every, like, was it 60 seconds or every, every, like, minute and a half or whatever? Look at that. How, how, how? That would drive me absolutely up the wall, right? And guys, she's, she's complaining about how lonely pregnancy is, right? Guys, how are you? Dude didn't even stick around um, during the pregnancy. She got pregnant by Pookie and Nug Nug, right? And homeboy just disappeared into the mist like freaking Batman. It <laughs> Guys, man, don't feel bad for them. They bring this on themselves. And guys, they always want a clean cleanup, man. She's pregnant. She's having a baby, man. You got to go in there. You got to help her. Here I come to save the day. No way, dude. Don't do it, guys. It's not worth it. All right, you guys. This is AJ. I appreciate you guys. Like, subscribe. I'm out of here, guys. Have a good one.